My name is Jamshid Daragdavi, and I really do appreciate this opportunity to share with you the feeling about my great mentor, dear friend, and partner, business partner of last day. He's not with us anymore, but his memory will live on. I will cherish it for the rest of my life. Ross Eikhoff, with sheer excellence and hard work, defied the conventional wisdom that being ahead of your time is more tragic than falling behind. But nevertheless, he had to fight and he had to confront the old God in every turn of his colorful career. He came to understand that choice is one of the critical dimensions of human being. And this was against what the conventional academic culture wanted to do. They didn't want to disturb the beautiful, well grinded analytical analysis that they had used. But Ross had the courage to take on this concept of choice, this messy concept of choice. Ross had come to this conclusion that with the notion of the choice, social systems, they stay at the level of the complexity, well above mechanical and biological thinking. And he felt a need <coughs> to convey that message. And it was for this, to cope with this challenge, that he started to think about design. In 1974, he told me personally that design is a vehicle by which choice can be manifest. And he told me that science is about what it is, but design is about what it ought to be. And designers seek to choose rather than predict the future. This world still rings in my ears that the future is not contained in the past. Much of it is yet to be written. And the designers have a lot to say about this. Ironically, but not surprisingly, his interactive design, 35 years after its inception, is still more potent and more profound than what has recently emerged as design thinking. Eikhoff's formulation goes much further than being just a vehicle for advancement of innovation. It aims at the core of social transformation, which was his lifetime passion. Eikhoff, above all his greatness, was a great friend, wonderful friend, an exceptional human being. The world will be much less pleasant place to be in the dark. And I already miss you very dear. Thank you.